to take a look. Ah, perfection. <laughs> Greetings, this is another Armored Warfare video and today I'm going to play the AS-90. Now, this is a British uh, self-propelled gun and it's a contract uh, tank, which means that uh, by playing some missions you get some points and when you get enough points you get a free premium tank. Previously you could have unlocked the Centurion average at best and now you get another British T8 premium and it's rather nice. Would I recommend getting the AS90? Of course, it's a free premium tank, however, keep this in mind, uh, playing Ortiz it can be frustrating so make sure to get at least the Acacia, uh, just to make sure that you enjoy the playstyle. Now, for the tank itself, as a contract mission tank, you have to do some extra missions to unlock uh, some of the modules, and that's uh, kind of annoying, but uh, that's life, I guess. Uh, and as for the crew and uh, equipment, I use uh, Sabrina as my uh, commander, because her uh, module damage uh, improvement uh, really helps out with my HG only loadout, uh, I'll get to that in a bit. And uh, these are the rest of the crew skills, now for the equipment, uh, energy drink is always helpful and uh, some extra stuff here and yeah, that's it really, let's go. Uh, you know what, let's forget that game ever happened. Uh, let's uh, try again. All right, Operation Leviathan. Oh hi! As you can see, I can just aim uh, in this general area, and uh, I disable its gun, and I damage its ammo rack, which is somewhere around there. This is the power of the AG shells. Never underestimate them. Oh look, an ass. Get colonized, motherfucker. Hi. I'm going to smoke. Uh, a huge negative is that uh, you only get uh, more smoke grenades if you play some contract missions because that's an unlockable module. Uh, until then, you have two small grenade launchers, I think, I, al I always forget, but that BMP team will never forget that uh, ass penetration. Oh look, a Merkava. Get colonized. Oh look, a Drago. Oops, a 1600 damage. Oh look, a K2. 666 damage. How wonderful. <laughs> Hi. Gun disabled. Let's smoke. And wait for my teammate to spot them. And... Done. Dead. Oh, a hunter. I hate these vehicles with a passion. Look, look, ammo rack. I I learned these uh, weak spots. Whenever you are playing with an AG only RT, you have to learn weak spots, and uh, it's rewarding. Trust me. Boom. Oh, gun disabled. Nice. I just have to shoot at that spot again and hopefully it's an ammo rack. Yes. This is what I'm saying. Never use heats. I know it can be annoying that you are looking at, uh, I don't know, a murder and uh, you cannot uh, HE pen its side and you would rather use heat at that moment, but trust me. Use HE only. 
and whenever you have the chance use WP uh, sometimes it's useful I uh, personally bring 15 WP rounds with me because uh, once 10 uh, of them uh, proved to be insufficient in numbers so I brought ex an extra 5 and I basically never fire 45 HE shells so uh, it was a trade I was willing to accept ouch I did I hit myself what um hi I am currently editing this video and uh, take a look at this boom just when I fired at the Pindad, the Type 96 came in front of me and he caught my HE shell. He didn't get damaged, of course, there's no uh, team damage uh, in this game mode. However, I hurt myself. The HE shell got caught on him, detonated, and that explosion had enough penetration to hurt me seriously. Uh, that's basically what happened. It was just a little accident, and uh, it was quite funny actually now that I look at it. <laughs> yeah, uh, that's the explanation. That's a pin dot. I hate those fuckers. Oh, look, it's kinda dead now. Just three more seconds. And feel the power of British imperialism. I am spotted. Oh shit. And I don't. I didn't have a smoke grenades. Uh, what can I say? It's uh, unlucky. Uh, just like that Sphinx. <laughs> Merkavas and uh, just uh, Russian and Soviet vehicles in general, uh, those are uh, very tough opponents for uh, HE only artists. However, when you see them showing uh, their sides, it's uh, not that big of a deal. Unlike this uh, HE penetration into the ass of this uh, Chinese. Oh fuck. Alright, my teammate will take care of that fucker. And... Oh, look at that. Another S penetration. AS-21. I genuinely hate that vehicle with a passion. And that's because I actually played it. And uh, let's take out that uh, Griffin. Another 650 damage. It basically deals as much damage as a as an AP round from a 125mm gun and on top of that it does module damage to the full vehicle basically. So it's good, HE only artists, that's the way. Alright, I have that 24k damage, that's really good, the second most in my team and uh, yeah, let's have another one. Alright, this mech is really, really good uh, with uh, every class. And I'm going to show you a spot which uh, I uh, really enjoy uh, using to its fullest of potentials. But uh, in order to get to that uh, area, I have to travel through the entire map, uh, basically. Alright, I'm here. The AS-90 is actually pretty mobile. Uh, well, I wouldn't say it's the most mobile vehicle in the game. It isn't. However, it isn't slow either. And that just uh, works out for me. And uh, this is why I uh, bring uh, WP with me. I can uh, just uh, do uh, area damage and uh, set things on fire. 
And that's the strategy on this map. I use WP and uh, set things on fire. As you can see, the challenger already uh, caught on fire. This is uh, why I bring uh, WP rounds for these exact situations. Oh, that's an ammo wreck. <laughs> and you can see even more because being uh, damaged by my WP rounds. Ooh, that's another fire. Ooh, I guess that's an ammo rack as well. <laughs> I shot that uh, a bit uh, too close to me. Hell yeah. Oh, that's another fire. Another one. Target A target destroyed. See, WP rounds are great. If I keep getting spotted, I might get uh, exterminated, and I only have one WP round left. That's uh, rather uncomfortable. However, now comes the real fun. The 1600 damage HE pants. Uh, or not. I've done a thousand, no, 15,000 damage, yes, just by spamming WP. Who needs strategy anyways? Can I do ugly things to that Stingray? Uh, no, but apparently I splash damage that uh, PLO one to death. Uh, I'll take that. Now, here's... Here comes the really funny shell. Uh, take a look. Ah, perfection. Alright, another 24k damage. The most in my team. Just by spamming a WP. Uh, and some HE shells here and there, but uh, WP was the MVP on, on this uh, game. And uh, yeah, that's the AS90, a wonderful vehicle, which I don't recommend to those who don't like playing artillery, but if you do like playing artillery, just like I do, uh, this is a golden opportunity to get a good premium tank. <clears throat> so yes, I would say it's worth getting. And I hopefully convinced you of this fact <laughs> by uh, playing some good games with it. And uh, I guess that's it. Thanks for paying attention. If you enjoyed the video, hit the dislike button. If not, hit the dislike button. If you want, you can unsubscribe and tell me in the comments what you think of this vehicle. Bye.